so happy for you. You're such a liar. Stay away from me, bitch. I'm really happy for you. Rose? It's all over school. What is? I don't know who, but somebody saw you and Claire at the movies. Is it true you two are making out? Oh, God. I came running as soon as I heard. Guess she really isn't his girlfriend. Hey, Kenny, does that make you the beard? Deal. Yes, it is. Lizzie Erickson is out there right now telling everyone. Well, maybe she is and maybe she isn't. This is all gonna blow over in like a week. Maybe not this week, but like eventually. How can you be so okay with this? I don't know. Maybe I've just had more time to come to terms with me. Plus, everybody already knew or assumed anyway. Do you remember the first time we spoke? Yeah, it was in here, actually. I had just come from Miss Monish's religion class. And she was asking me what it felt like to be a sinner and what it was going to be like to go to hell. I stood up for myself and I accepted it and I owned it. And that shut her up right away. And then I came in here and cried my brains out. <laughs> <laughs> and then you came in. And even though I didn't ask you what was wrong, I knew I could relate. And you were so beautiful. Wait, so y you were out back then? Rose, it's not like you're in one day and you're out the next. It's a process. I met a guy at my first P-Flag meeting who said that even though he's been out for 30 years, he's still coming out every day, every new friend, every new job. You're so smart. Wait, we're in school. No one's here. We're in Catholic school. Even better. <laughs> oh, your breath is really terrible. Oh, right now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, let's get out of here, okay? I'm not ready to go out there with you. Oh. No pressure. Sure, we got four. Oh, Vanessa, I haven't seen you around lately. I know. My life pretty much sucks. Yeah, I don't get it. I mean, I know you're not allowed, but it's not like your parents have 24 hour surveillance on you. You two could totally hang out without them knowing. I don't know. You could. No. It'd be easy. Yeah, it'd be easy keeping it from my parents, but. Being with her and not being 
with her. Claire? So I take it you heard the headline news? They're really happy, aren't they? Can you please tell her something for me? No matter what happens, I'm gonna be okay. Ever wanted to kiss a girl? No. Well, maybe we should. Just, you know, see. <sighs> Vanessa, stop leaving your shoes in front of the doorway. I'm sorry. <sighs> Come on, honey, someone could trip. No, I'm sorry. Did you have a bad day? No. You're wearing two different socks. I know. Mom and I specifically agreed that it's okay. I know, I know, I know. I was just... Oh. Hi, honey. Hi. You just get in? Yep. Uh, Vanessa had a bad day. What's wrong? Nothing, it's fine. What is it? You can tell us. No, I can't. Is this a female thing? Should I leave the room? It, no, no, it's not a female thing. It, it's nothing. Vanessa, you're starting to get me worried. Oh, for crying out loud, I just had a bad day at school, okay? And I don't want to talk about it. Okay, we can leave you alone with that. If there's anything you need to talk about, you can come to us. You know that. Yeah, of course. Rose. She's out to like the whole school. I thought we agreed that you'd be staying away from her. Yeah, well it's kind of hard when you go to the same school and have all the same classes. Besides, everyone's going on about how happy they are for her and what a cute couple she and this other girl make. It's like headline news. So she's going through with it then? Girlfriend and everything? Going through with it. God, you're so- Vanessa, you watch it. You have no idea how happy she is. I mean, yeah, she's freaked out, but I know her, and underneath she's glad. She's being herself. She's free. Oh, honey. Vanessa, we know she was a good friend, but we have to look out for you, and we just want to keep you happy. We, we just want what's best for you. She has it so much better than me. That's not very fair to us. It's not very fair for me. Now, you listen to me, Vanessa. We want you to be happy. We want you to be yourself. Then let me! Oh, for Pete's sake, Vanessa, what are you trying to say? You want to be a gay too? No! Who would want to be gay? I don't know what I am. I'm so confused and it doesn't matter anyway because you wouldn't support me. You are not gay. Is that understood? And as long as you live under this roof, you are our responsibility. And that means no more of this gay nonsense. I am not gay, I just said that! Yeah, well then, what are you? I don't know. I just want to be happy. Clearly, I can't be living here with you. Vanessa, now you come back in here.
Coming out isn't easy for anyone. Whether you're struggling to find the words to talk about your sexual orientation or gender identity, or confronting a friend or loved one who's just come out as lesbian, gay, bisexual, or trans, please know that you're not alone. PFLAG Canada is there to help. Visit them online at pflagcanada.ca for more information or to find a support meeting near you. PFLAG Canada is there when no one else is.